Using powerful computer simulations, researchers from Brown University have identified a material with a higher melting point than any known substance. The computations, described in the journal Physical Review B, Rapid Communications, showed that a material made with just the right amounts of hafnium, nitrogen, and carbon would have a melting point of more than 4,400 kelvins 7,460 degrees Fahrenheit. That's about two-thirds the temperature at the surface of the sun, and 200 kelvins higher than the highest melting point ever recorded experimentally. The experimental record holder is a substance made from the elements hafnium, tantalum, and carbon, HF Tasi. But these new calculations suggest that an optimal composition of hafnium, nitrogen, and carbon HFN 0.38 C 0.51 is a promising candidate to set a new mark. The next step which the researchers are undertaking now is to synthesize material and corroborate the findings in the lab. The advantage of starting with the computational approach is we can try lots of different combinations very cheaply and find ones that might be worth experimenting with in the lab, said Axel van de Waal, associate professor of engineering and CEO author of the study with postdoctoral researcher Kai Jun Hong. Otherwise we'd just be shooting in the dark. Now we know we have something that's worth a try. The researchers used a computational technique that infers melting points by simulating physical processes at the atomic level, following the law of quantum mechanics. The technique looks at the dynamics of melting as they occur at the nanoscale, in blocks of 100 or so atoms. The technique is more efficient than traditional methods, but still computationally demanding due to the large number of potential compounds to test. The work was done using the National Science Foundation's SID Computer Network and Brown's Oscar High Performance Computer Cluster.